The story of Crazy Joe was torn from yesterday's headlines, and it's as terrifying as tomorrow's. Good morning, Crazy Joe coming to you on a hot Wednesday afternoon. It is the day after the 4th of July. It is quite hot in the Philly area. I just made a run to the Half Off store, which is a store in my area that sells discounted items at, surprise, half off. They seem to get things from Target, and then they sell them for half of what Target would sell them for. But today is my wedding anniversary. I've been married nine years today, and unfortunately, this is going to be a weird video. This is going to be more of a, a day-in-the-life video <laughs> than, uh, than my usual adventures. But um, I was in a car accident last week. Last week I was in a car accident. My car was uh, very much damaged. Uh, I'm here to tell you it was not my fault. It was the other guy's fault. I had the right of way. A guy decided to violate the traffic lanes and cross over. But uh, my car's in the shop. See this silver Kia Sportage here? It's a Kia Sportage. This is, for all intents and purposes, the crazy Joe-mobile for the next uh, week or so. Uh, I was in this car accident last week. This is not a car I would have chosen for myself. It was all they had available. Look at this, look at the key, look at the key. It's got like a switchblade key. Look at that. My, uh, my car is keyless, it's a push button, but now I'm back to a key and it's a switchblade key. There's also not a whole lot, of, I'm a big guy, not a whole lot of leg room in this thing. I drive a Nissan Rogue. Oh, there's the radio. So this thing is not the car I would have chosen for myself. But why do I bring up this car accident? Well, today's my nine year wedding anniversary. I wake up this morning, my wife hands me a card and I realized I don't have a card for her. I bought her a card. I bought her a card, but it's in my car. And my car is at the body shop. So I told her, I said, oh, Christine, I got a card for you. It's at the body shop. So you know what we're going to do? I left a couple things in the car, including my daughter's booster seat, my phone charger, a couple items I left in the car. So I think we're going to go drive over to the body shop and see if we can get my wife's anniversary card, my car charger, and uh, Kira's booster seat. So there you go. Well, check it out. Kia Sportage. Again, not the car I would choose for myself, but unfortunately the car I'm stuck with for at least the next week. All right, let's go get crazy. Coming up on Crash Champions. Crash Champions, that is where my car is. We're gonna go there. We're gonna get the, get the items I left in the car, hopefully. Hopefully I can get the items because I don't know if they're working on the car actively as we speak they may not they may not allow it there's my car back there you can see he's working on it he's i told him what i need he's going to get it for me they can't let me back obviously but he's grabbing the things i need they're working on my front bumper now and they're repainting the car there we go I also saw some of the some of the parts are actually in the trunk of the car right now. So they did end up uh, taking me in the back to uh, to the car. I got to see a little bit of the car. It's uh, yeah, the front fender has been removed. They took all the broken pieces and put them in the trunk. They opened the trunk. I wish I'd gotten that on video for you, but all the broken pieces from the front of the car were jammed into the trunk of my car. But I got Kira's car seat here. That's, that's all right, be. Kira's booster seat we needed. I needed the car charger. And most importantly, uh, I wanted this to land face up. <laughs> Christine's anniversary card. So that's, that's done. And in the meantime, my car is still back there at Crash Champions being worked on. And hopefully, hopefully I'll have it back. They, they're estimating next Thursday. Uh, a week from tomorrow because it is Wednesday now so a week from tomorrow they think they're gonna have that car back to me <sighs> and I can't wait to get it back because I am not crazy about this Kia 
It's not the car I wanted. It's the car I'm stuck with. But the important thing we must remember, the important thing is nobody got hurt. Nobody got hurt in the accident. And that's the important thing, right? Uh, you know, I was fine. The other guy was fine. The only damage was to items, pro property. And that could be repaired. That's what's insurance for. I know this is not the most thrilling Crazy Joe adventure you've ever seen, but thank you for joining me on this rather mundane adventure. I, I would, I want to say ordinary adventure, but I can't. I can't because uh, Peter Scaretta and Kitra have ordinary adventures all wrapped up. I, uh, I don't want to step on their toes, so I'm going to say mundane adventure. It was a mundane adventure today, but thank you for joining me on it. We'll get on some good Crazy Joe adventures in the very near future. I have a few ideas up in the old noggin of uh, places we're going to go, things we're going to see in the, uh, in the coming uh, month or so. And uh, stay tuned for that. Ornament premiere is coming. You know, ornament premiere, that's a big thing on this channel. We always do the Hallmark ornament premiere, and it's coming in July. It is July. It is this month. So very soon you'll be seeing my ornament premiere video that I do every July. Uh, and then we got other things coming up, other exciting things. If you, you know, if you looked at this video and you're like, this is, this is dull. Why do I want to watch a guy go get stuff out of his wrecked car? This is not the average Crazy Joe adventure. This isn't what we usually do on this channel. This is just something a little different because, um, we're kind of, kind of stuck, kind of stuck, you know, <laughs> for the moment, but big adventures on the way. So if you... Tell, tell a friend about us. Like, subscribe, tell a friend. More people join in the fun. And uh, until next time, we're going to get crazy again very soon. And keep wearing those pajamas. Keep wearing those pajamas. With the plastic feet. Keep wearing those pajamas. Tell everyone you Long need. with the keep retro, bro. Keep wearing those pajamas. Bro. With the back door flap. Keep wearing those pajamas. Don't open it to trap. Some people call them bitches, some people call them jammies They can come embroidered with big money and no whammies They can have a hundred tiny commander and damas But no matter how they look, just keep on wearing those pajamas Keep on wearing those pajamas Keep wearing those pajamas And now we're having fun Keep wearing those pajamas And now the song is done